Hi, in this video, we're going to solve this differential equation. We have x times the square root of one minus y dx minus the square root of one minus x squared dy, and that's equal to zero. And this is a separable differential equation, which means we should be able to separate it. So we have only x's with the dx and only y's with the dy. So we'll start by basically adding this to both sides, this piece here. So we have x square root one minus y dx equals square root one minus x squared dy. So just taking this and adding it to the other side. And um, this square root one minus y needs to be over here. So I'm gonna divide by this. Likewise, divide by this so it's over here. So we'll end up with x over the square root of one minus x squared dx, right, dividing by this, and then divide by this, so over here you get um, one over the square root of one minus y dy. All right, now we can integrate both sides because you see we have only x's in a dx and only y's in a dy. This integral here requires a substitution. We can let u be the piece that's inside the square root here. So u is one minus x squared, so then du is simply going to be negative 2x dx. And we don't have a negative 2 in the integrand, so we want to make this look like this, so we'll divide by negative 2, divide by negative 2. So we get negative 1 half du equals x dx. Okay, so now we're ready to make the substitution on this one. So basically the x dx, that's going to be negative 1 half du, so I'll pull out the negative 1 half. Here we have a du, and then on the bottom we just have the square root of, and we said that piece was u, so that's just going to be u. Equals, over here we can do the same thing. I'll let um, w equal 1 minus y. So dw is minus dy. Oh, but there's no minus here, so you have to multiply or divide by the minus 1, so you get minus dw equals dy. And now we're ready to make the substitution. The dy is going to give us a minus, I'll pull it out, dw over the square root of w. In both of these cases, basically we write each of these to the one half power and then bring them up and so therefore the exponent becomes negative. So this is negative one half, u to the negative one half, du equals negative, and then here we have w to the negative one half dw. Again, basically this is w to the one half, and you bring it up and it becomes negative. Same thing here. This is u to the one half, you bring it up and it becomes negative. We can eliminate these negatives, just divide them away so they're gone, so I'm just gonna do that. And then here, when we integrate, we add one and divide by the result. When you add one to negative one half, you get one half, and then you divide by one half. So you have one half, u to the one half over one half. And then here we have one half over one half plus c. Okay, this is the square root of u. u is one minus x squared. When you divide by one half, you really multiply by two. So this is going to be two square root. And then w was one minus y plus our constant of integration, capital C. We can stop here, you can keep going, and you can probably, you could solve for y in this case, but I'll just stop here and leave that as the answer. Good luck.